I might lose my temper. <laughs> Welcome back guys, welcome back. As you can tell, fall is in the air. I got a hoodie on, beautiful morning. A little chilly, but it's moving along. It's starting to smell like dying corn. I wanna show you what we were working on yesterday. <laughs> you <laughs> took too long. I was wondering how, I knew you guys were there. I heard the door. So, you know, I was just seeing how long you guys were gonna wait it out. Yeah, I mean, you were just scared. Hiding. To get scared. I was scared, dude. Where Come. were you all morning? We got the whole thing done. <laughs> Don't you notice how pretty I am? My haircut? Yeah. Sure. I didn't even notice. Looks nice. I like what you did with the front and the back. Thank you. I was looking at mine. I think I need one, but I'm just going to let her go until Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh. So you want to tell them about our big project here? Concrete. Well, you guys Concrete work. Mason, what do you, masonry. <laughs> you guys put a door in, so now. Yeah, so we have to. The, the, uh, the footer here for the wall, the door is going to close onto gravel, so we have to pour cement on the inside. So then you might as well do the outside. So we worked all day yesterday on you know, I got dirt work, more or less, and putting up our forms. Tomorrow, I guess we get to pour it, so that'll be fun. Doug delivered some bad news. What? And you may have knew, knew this, but I didn't until this morning. They cut over there. Yeah. And that, like, eight feet of old concrete was supposed to come out. Oh, that's good news. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so we got that going for us. Well, don't mind our wiring here. <laughs> <laughs> it's only 12 volt. I noticed that you guys left this here. We got to tie this together. Well, we were shorted on rebar. What are you going to do? <laughs> what are you going to do? So, nonetheless... It's going to look a lot better now, having cement here. And this door, walk door, used to be right there, so they moved that down. So we had the, I think we're putting in about 45 feet of cement by 6 feet. Would like to go farther, but we want it to be all symmetrical. Why would you film when I don't even know what I'm doing? <laughs> <laughs> this ain't my... Get me back into a tractor. Busted. Busted it off. <laughs> what are these rated for? Brody? No, you just gotta know your limits. I never have known my limits. Winding. Bust. Stop. stop. Oh, it's not even tight. That's why you don't tell me to stop. <laughs> well, it looks like we're all set up, Brody. Too bad we don't have any concrete today. Well, too bad, huh? They weren't, uh, we didn't call her early enough yesterday to get concrete today, so tomorrow morning project, I guess. It would be a beautiful morning to do it, too. Nice and cool, but there's always tomorrow. New project. We've got a tile inlet in one of these black bean fields that I don't know what happened, but she's been damaged or... <laughs> it needs some maintenance, let's just say. So we're... Me and Eric are down here, we're gonna run out there. I'm gonna dig down with the backhoe and see what we got going in cement tile so that's not ab abnormal to have issues with it, especially on the inlets. So we'll, let's go find out what's going on. I hate this part. thing I'm very happy about is this Kodiak and that trailer. No more using that dump truck. 
That's, that's nice. How do we want to attack this? Which way does the line go, the main? Oh, it's full of dirt. Oh, okay. Well, we'll just attack by attacking then. There's weeds growing in it. <laughs> Imagine that. Try to do here. <laughs> well, we gotta expose, I suppose, down to the main line to see what, why, why it's sucking dirt. I thought being an operator meant you didn't have to use the, the hand shovel. Look how big that toad is. <laughs> he was buried underground. He's a dinosaur. I don't know if I've ever seen anything like what this is. Someone's been out with their sack creep, I think. <laughs> <laughs> it's something. I have a feeling someone before us has been working on this. That would come right off. I think I'm going to let you do what you want to do here. Which is? <laughs> Break it off. <laughs> it looks to me as if where they connected this, this tile is busted down the top. So I think it was sucking dirt and and it's been driven on or something and collapsed it. Oh yeah, and it's plump full of trash. Yuck. You wanna borrow my gloves? <laughs> yeah, it's been busted. It's broken. Well, that's why we're here to fix it, as you can see. That's not supposed to be like that. At least we're not working in mud. Oh, it's six inch. All right, well this, this will work. We can work with this. I even have the right stuff. I even brought the right stuff. So now what we're gonna do is we'll probably get, expose more here, take out a few more, and then we'll shove a T in there. Or, well, yeah, probably a T to come up for the inlet. And then we'll just coupler to it. We'll have a plastic inlet and no more broken cement tile. That'll ride. So we're gonna go with plastic. This should fit right over the existing concrete, concrete. tile. And then we're gonna take this piece and this will go inside and we'll splice in a little chunk and we'll be back up and running here as soon as the Swede gets done doing all of the work. Yeah, <laughs> just hang tight, folks. <laughs> Today's workout is brought to you by Junk Tile ink. How far back am I going here? To the back hole. Yeah, I'm going to make you keep going and we're going to pretend we're the guy's hand laying. <laughs> She's fighting me. <laughs> when in doubt, force it. All right, so my tee don't fit like I thought it was going to over the tile. So we're going coupler, coupler, Short piece of tile, short piece of tile, slam, bam, wham. Boom. Boom. So we're done. One more cut. Here. Push the dirt in. One more, one more cut and then we'll be ready. Eyeball that in there. Okay. Now is when the bending and the real fight begins. Okay, that side's in. It's almost like he's been a trench boy before. <laughs> Okay. That'll, that'll ride. That's clean. That worked out really nice. Yep. 
Okay, now we put our standpipe in, back fill around, and we're ready to roll. I'm going to tape that yeah, on there. I was there. Say we should probably... It's like we never did anything. Happy with that? I think so. Cut it a little long because we can always cut off more. Yeah? Sure. You missed some. There we go. No gloves. It's a new flag. That'll itch later. <laughs> well, we're back at the farm, and I guess we get to go combine some uh, black turtle beans that we sprayed. Well, they should have been able to be harvested when we were out there, but they were just still a little too green. Now it's been four days and it got rained on, so rehydrated hopefully, and we can go combine four acres. Still won't be able to complete it, but we're gonna get some more. It's hard to steer in video at the same time, guys. So, right here is what we're after. We've got, I don't know, like four, three or four spots out here. This is kind of a valley, so they had more moisture, they lived longer, so when we sprayed them, they weren't quite ready. When we were here the first time, well now I, I'm sure they're overdone. <laughs> but we're here to clean up. We're here to clean her up. Fortunately, this uh, is only a mile from the farm, so it's not like we gotta go very far. It's always good when everything starts. These are actually really, really good beans. 5,000 pound beans right there. Unbelievable. Man, this didn't take long at all. That was it. That was it. Well, that was actually a really, really nice sample. They're like 14.5 to 15%. I got two dumps worth and I'm not done. So those are the beans that we just sprayed a couple of days ago. They're still green or they're just starting to die. So got another two acres there probably next week and we're done. That's all I got. This only took like 20 minutes. Took longer to get out here than it did the combine. Well, that was fun while it lasted. I need to look into that sound. Never used to make that loud buzzing sound when it's turning off. Somewhat concerning actually buzzing for quite a while. Did I do a good job, Brody? You did. Did I? Yeah. <laughs> good job supervising. I pulled the flag even. <laughs> it's go time. I just got done with my bologna sandwich and gotta wash my fingers because the bologna has got that succulent juices in it. <laughs> I oh, hear him. That truck is here. He's backwards. Well, if you didn't didn't guess it, it's a new day, and we're pouring. We're pouring. I'm not excited, <laughs> Brody. It's your favorite job. I wouldn't say that. No. It's fun. That's fine. When the job is done, <laughs> it could the shed could take it again. Good thing Doug ain't driving. It don't turn as sharp as the general. It's the food in your braces for me. I didn't eat nothing yet today. I shouldn't be. <laughs> Did you understand all of his hand signals? Oh, this, I was good when he that, was too. this. <laughs> We're screwed. <laughs> no chance. This ain't gonna work. Get him a radio. I'll just CB him. Yeah, there you Stop go. Stop the spinny thing. <laughs> oh boy. Up to the top again. What was it? Stop. Hey, look out. It's about to go up. It's about to go up. Hey, I think we need more water. Let's get some more water, man. Dad choked under the first direction he had to get him. What was that? What was that direction? I like these little horns. This is neat. Yeah. Oh, Brody, look at that. 
What? You're good, bro. It's like you did it all your life. <laughs> go, 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 Forward! Look at... <laughs> forward! Forward! Stop! Pull it back! <laughs> At least we got the camera. I might lose my temper. Sometimes you just have to put the camera down for a little bit, apparently. Alright, little clean up on aisle three. So we got the inner part cord. This is actually where the door is going to be closing down onto. So that looks really nice. We screeded it. We put this poly down so that we have a little bit of a lip so water goes that way rather than in the building. So we got a little over a quarter inch raise. Now for the big part. Big but not overwhelming. Should be simple. We're coming to the point of finding out if we're gonna have enough or not. He's upgraded to the walkie-talkie. Yeah, <laughs> really the only way to do it. Well, I think we had enough. That's good. Now this door is gonna close nice and level, so are we level? I've had better experiences in that. Wasn't bad, but I've had better. Well, <laughs> He's the only guy here with high blood pressure right now. <laughs> I've seen where the absolute whole form <laughs> blows out when we were doing a step for my dad on his old house one time. The whole, whole form blew out and half a yard underneath the trailer house. And it was something. <laughs> Was there as much profound language as what was said here moments ago? I blocked it all out. I don't remember a thing. <laughs> oh, well, you're doing good. You're doing an excellent job. Oh, well, I'm glad that project's over. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I sure did. <laughs> I like it when he loses his composure. Anyways, guys, I think that's going to be a wrap on today's video or the last couple days video. I hope you enjoyed it. Why won't this turn off? And, uh, Make sure to subscribe and like and check in on the next video. Thank you guys. See you next time. <laughs>